the government has not uh, stopped assessing the risk of um, uh, COVID-19 uh, outbreak or the infection status of different places or countries or territories over the, all over the world. So um, the risk factors may depend on, say, the number of confirmed cases, the trend of increase in these numbers, also the evidence of whether there's any uh, local or community spread or whether the community spread is extensive, that sort of factors. And we all know these risk factors will change over time. And it can be um, increasing or decreasing. And of course, one reference value that we, one reference information that we can um, look at is the number of confirmed cases from the first batch of Wuhan returnees, uh, Hong Kong residents. So um, among that uh, batch of Hong Kong returnees, out of uh, more than 450 samples, there only are pay or, or individuals. There's only one confirmed case, so the uh, rate is quite low. And of course, we'll continue to monitor the situation.